I'm in here going through all this, and then people act like they don't understand that I like booty. So what? But what is I'm supposed to do, bro? Huh? I don't. I don't know. You tell me. You don't know. I don't know. Can I, I can't picture myself ever being in that situation. All right. I just say, for instance, you was in that situation. Uh, uh, I can't. I can't see it, please. I can't think about it. You would turn me down. What you mean? Huh? It's more important than Wilder. You should know I, what I mean. <laughs> I can't see it, please. I, and I'm going to tell you why. I'm going to tell you why. Listen, I just can't even picture myself ever being locked up. That's good. That's good. I, I, I will do anything to stay out of prison. Yeah. Like, I, will, I won't steal, kill, destroy, nothing. That's good. I knew from a very early age that I'm not built for that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And so I just never even wanted to put myself in that hypothetical Good situation. Thing, so know. when I was seeing you. No, I, I ain't saying it's to be uh, uh, disrespectful. No, no, no. Actually. I don't think it's disrespectful. I think that it's. No, a, I think you're cute, for real. But I, me? Yeah. No, me. Not, not in that look. Listen, not me. <laughs> I'm saying. <laughs> hold up. Good looking. Let's, let's say it like that. <laughs> Good looking. Well, if you was locked up, if, if you was locked up, like, yeah, I and we was locked up, I, I would talk to you. No. Yeah, I would. <laughs> yeah, I got to see some, what's up with you, right? I mean, you don't think you look good? Not that, I don't look that good. Do you think you look good? Nah. Do you think you got a nice body? No. Nice butt? Nope. I do. <laughs> Jesus Christ. See, you got low self-esteem, but let's get back. I'm going to show you respect. You know, you my... Enemy. No, you can say whatever you want to say. Can I for real? You can say whatever you want to say. Man. Well, wait, wait, wait. Let me, let me redirect the questions first. All of these guys out here, right? Mm -hmm. And they come out and they say... As long as you mind your business, Boy, crap. That's, that's crap. And as long as you don't get involved in different stuff, that's crap. That you ain't never ever gotta. That's crap. That's crap. That's crap. Just like out here in the streets. I mean, common sense to tell you, you got people out here. They out here working. Just like you and your wife, them. Y'all out here working. Y'all ain't bothering nobody. You minding your business, but right. somebody would steal, steal from you, rob you, right, right, right. Her, all this. It's the same in penitentiary. So all of these guys are saying that Man, they go in there and mind their business, they lying. What color is bro? A brown. Damn. It's my favorite color, too. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously, my... <laughs> no, man, you fucking me up, man. I mean... I don't mean no disrespect. Oh. I, I got... Well, well, we out of time? Are we almost done? All right, give, just give me five more minutes, seven, at least five. Go ahead, go ahead, please. No, man, uh, oh, here's, oh. Here's, the, here's the thing. I'm, a, I'm married now, right? Are you married? Man, I got out of prison, man. I knew one or two things, man. I said to myself, all I went through now was an experience, right? I look at my whole life as different experiences going from one thing to the next. I'm never, ever going to get into an experience where I'm trapped in. Well, hold on, hold on, please, because I got a limited amount of time, so I'm curious. Yeah. I got to ask you a question. So, I come into prison, hypothetically, right? You took your glasses off just so I can. No, nah, I got. I, got <laughs> yes, <you did. laughs> I just talked about your ass, man. <laughs> Trying to tease me, bro. Oh my God. Good gracious. So I, 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 I hit the, I hit the yard. You about your ass, and you talk, you wanted me to see your ass, right? On my brown ass. Yeah, he can't be all right. <laughs> and I want what you saying. Man. So I hit the yard, right? And you spot me, right? And you be like, okay, listen, I like that guy right there, right? No, it don't happen like that. How do it happen? First of all, prison is big on one thing, respect. Uh -huh. First of all, I'm going to find out who you are, where you come from, who your people are. You do all of that research before? Yeah, I do the research. We know you're coming before you even get there. 
They got a thing called move sheet. All that be on the move sheet. Transfers, who's coming in, who's going out, who made parole, who died. And it's all on the move sheet. Mm -hmm. So when I see it, I, I have you checked out first, right? If I think you're a cool brother, I'm not going to bring shit to you, right? Mm -hmm. I ain't bringing nothing to you. Try to help you. Man, I done saved a lot of people in that prison. Seriously. I believe it. People tell my wife all the time, he saved my life and all that. She said, did you save, you, you actually saved that guy? I said, yeah. She said, you are so good. But she don't realize I saved his life because I was fucking him. That's why I say this goddamn way. I didn't say it. <laughs> Ain't nothing free, man. Shit. Put my life on the land and all that. What we're talking about. So when these guys come out of jail, don't. I don't want to talk to them. Well, no, 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 no. When they come out of jail and they say, hey, I just did my time and I just came home, don't believe it. What you mean? Don't believe that they didn't get themselves involved in something. That man, did. if you believe it, you, you, you crazy. Now, you got people in uh, the toughest that I done seen, man. You got, I, I done talked to everybody, you know. I done talked to all the serial killers, the murderers, the gangsters, the, the gang, especially them gangs. They got, I done talked to, they keep each other strong if they click up, right? Yeah, and yeah. Uh, you can't get to them because they clicked up in the gang. Yeah. You get them by themselves, man. Whew. Boy, they got some asses in her, though. Them, 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 I seen some, some ass in her that make make your feet turn up. Just twelve, uh, twelve your toes, bro. But here's the thing about it. No, I'm serious. I mean, that's the first time I was in her. That's why I got my nut at in the penitentiary, right? So, I mean. I try to learn that, uh, and my, oh, my wife, she told me, she said, I'm doing my ass like that. I said, you having fun? <laughs> she said, uh, did it hurt the first time? I said, I ain't going to call her name out. I said, baby. I'm not even gonna answer that crazy question. Cause if I said it didn't hurt, you gonna say, oh, you took all that. If I said it did hurt, you gonna say, damn. I said, so you know what? It's a little retarded question. If I got a beautiful wife though, you know, we 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 talk, man, but she knows that at the time I did what I did. Yeah. I did what I did. I did what I did. I had one, one, one in her that I ain't never think a man's ass could even make you feel that way. But <laughs> I love this one. This one here. You, you, know, you love it, man. Yeah, man. You do. If you ain't had nothing in the world, and, and let's say you and your wife broke up or something, uh, and y'all get back together. Ain't, ain't here, no. You ain't messed with nobody else or nothing like that. Y'all been away from each other about two, three years, and you held out. And when you when you, when you release yourself, you're gonna be like. <sighs> <laughs> so with me, I ain't never had none. Period. Uh huh. You know, in my life, and so I'm in here fighting and all this stuff, and I got custom to some ass, right? Mm hmm. And so. Ask yourself this, when a man look at a woman out of her, that's the main thing he looks at, her ass. Mm -hmm. Oh man, she got ass, this and that. Everything is based on ass, right? So when you go in prison, you in prison, locked up, you laying in your bed, you got a, a sister, they'll come down the hall with their booties hanging out and stuff. I'm talking about built. And they ain't like they talking to somebody. This is your cell. They know you in up looking. Mm -hmm. What you talking about? You ain't talking about nothing. You know, blah, 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 blah. And you laying out, you be like, damn. Mom got an ass on him. And then, here's what they do. You set the write her a letter. Yeah, baby. Well, I, 
Hopefully, uh, I make parole when I go get out. This and all that old stuff. Signing the lock. I was making sure they ready. Now, you know, just wrote you, telling you all this stuff. And you like, well, I'll be out here. I'll be waiting on you. Keep your head straight. And we're doing everything in our world to have you set up good support system. Mail your letter. Go right to that boy. Mm-hmm. And see, them sisters have changed the game in prison. We ain't chasing y'all no more. They chasing the sisters. Mm-hmm. Chasing them. Fighting over them. We'll give them. Man, I, I don't see one dude had a. Gave uh, a sister 175 acres of land on the street. Gave it to him. But I'm saying I would have gave more than that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say, say damn good. <laughs> <laughs>